Hello. Hello. Hi, class. Good morning. Good evening. Good evening, yes. Good evening. <laughs> How are you today? Good? Good. All right. Hi. And you? I'm good. I'm okay. Thank you. Great. It's hot. It's hot. <clears throat> Let me see, Daniel, Francisco, two Daniels, Alba, Genaro, Marvel, Captain Marvel. Iris, Iris, I have a question. Who is that in your picture? Hello, Iris Mulato. Uh -huh. Oh, it's a singer? Is, is that the singer from BTS or I don't know what their name is? Oh, it's not a woman or it's a man? Oh, Edis will be angry right now. It's a man, okay. Hello, Samuel. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, sir. How are you today? I'm fine, thanks. All right. Esperemos un ratito más a ver quién se mete y we finish. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Francisco. How are you? I'm fine. All right. Thank you. What about you? I'm okay too, thank you. Everything good. Okay, let's start. Oh, your daughters like BTS. What is BTS anyway? I was reading that. Okay, let me see. So remember yesterday we did, I used to, correct? Yes, it's correct. Yes. Yes, 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 I used to. What is I used to? The action only one time in the past or frequent? Is is in action uh, uh, frequently? Yes, it's an action you did frequently in the in the past. But we don't do it anymore. Okay. All right. Yes, it's an action we did in the past frequently. Yes. And maybe, maybe we do now, but not like in the past. All right. Okay. So let me see. Do you see my screen? 
Yes, teacher. All right, good. Let's do this. It says, knowledge check. Where did Jerry grow up? She grew up in Brinkton, England. She grew up in Brinkton, Ireland. Or she grew up in Brinkton. Wait a minute. She grew up in Brinkton. No hicimos el video. Hi, everyone. By the end of the... Yes, we did. Okay, where did Jerry grow up? She grew up in Brinkton, England. She grew up in Brinkton, England, or she grew up in England, Brinkton, England. What is the correct? Grew up. The third one. The world. The third one. Yes. Did, did Jerry have a hobby? Jerry used to paint and she still paints today. Jerry used to collect stamps. Jerry uses to go surfing. What is the correct? The first one. The first one. Yeah. The third one. Hmm? Okay, in my opinion, the first and the second are correct. Yes. Yes. Oh, no, 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 the yes. first is correct, but okay, used to. The first one because used. Yes, I'm sorry. Oh man, my glasses. <laughs> I have a problem. My vision from close is not good. From distance is excellent. <laughs> oh. I don't know if it's myopia or something, but close, I'm not very good. A big distance, I'm very good. Okay, next it says, choose the best response for this question. What games did you used to play when you were a kid? I used to play basketball and football when I was a kid. I used to play basketball and football when I was a kid. Hmm, so what is the difference here? Oh, okay. Or I used to play basketball and football when I was a kid. What is the correct? The second, the second one. one. Second. Yes. Why? What is the difference between the second and the first? There. The impression. All right, good. Choose the best response to this question. What did you use to collect when you were a kid? I used to collect comic books when I was a kid. I used to collect comic books when I was a kid, or I used to collect comic books when I was a kid. What is the correct? The first. The first one. Correct. Excellent. The first one. My last job was easy and relaxing. I blank worked from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Friday and had weekends off. You will have to have that kind of job. <laughs> yeah. 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 Man, that's. Y hora y media de almuerzo. So, what, what is the correct? I used to, used to, or was used to? Used to. Used to. The first one, right? Used, used first to first work one. for the government. Yes. <laughs> All right, now let me see. Next, it says, lesson objective. Build English conversation skills with the phrase used to, which you can use to describe your childhood or past. By the end of this class, oh, did you used to go? Okay, let's watch the video. Yeah, pues lo hacemos easier. Hi, everyone. Voy Oyeron. Yes. Okay. Hi, everyone. Okay. okay, good. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Today we're going. <laughs> <laughs> Saben que para mí la mejor forma de aprender algo es, hay, hay un lema que se llama kiss. Kiss, de beso, es keep it simple. Manténganlo simple. Y entre más fácil, ¿cómo les explico? Entre menos habla uno y explica más, es más fácil de aprender. 
por ejemplo, creo que ayer, ayer fue, pero me quiero acordar qué es lo que era, con, con Maribel creo que se llama, que no entendía la edad. Entonces me decía, ¿cuántos años tiene? No, how old are you? Y yo dije, por ejemplo, she is 27, he is 21, how old are you? Boom, capto. Oh, okay. So that's, that's a very good way to practice English. Okay, so let's watch the video. Hi, everyone. By the end of this class, you'll be able to make questions using used to. We'll practice making yes and no questions and WH questions. For example, you'll be able to make questions such as, what sports did you use to play when you were a child? Did you use to collect anything when you were a child? What kind of things did you use to do for fun when you were a kid? As I mentioned previously, what we're going to do in this class is we're going to learn how to form questions using used to. And what we're going to do is we're going to focus on creating yes and no questions as the one that I'm circling there that you use to collect things. That's a yes and no question. And then the way to answer that, yes, I used to collect comic books or no, I didn't use to collect anything. And also we're going to learn how to create those WH questions with used to. Let me start by presenting the structure. And what we're going to do is we're going to try to make sense of the two questions that are here. As you can see, the first question is a yes or no question. And the second question, what sports did you use to play? That's an information question. That means that we have a WH word. So let's try to make sense of the first one first. Um, the um, yes or no questions don't have a WH word and therefore start with did. So did you use to, and it follows the verb in the present, collect things. Did is the auxiliary that we're going to use, and then that follows the subject. In this case, it happens to be you. That is going to follow used to. If you notice, used to is not in the past. It's in the present. And then it's going to follow the verb in, in its present tense. And then finally, we'll have some sort of complement. And how do we answer this type of questions? Well, we can either have a positive response such as, yes, I used to collect comic books. Or no, I didn't use to collect anything, but now I collect art. So let me try to give a couple of more examples and we're going to continue to use that same structure. Um, we want to focus on doing yes and no questions at this moment. So let me ask you the following question. Did you used to listen to rock music? Okay. Did you, I'm going to say, did you play, play sports in high school? There we go. Now, let me talk about creating WH questions. As you can see, that's the one at the bottom. Um, I mentioned that WH questions, we use this kind of questions to ask for information. And we'll borrow the example, we'll borrow that question that you see there. What sport did you use to play? So let me go ahead and write that down. What um, sports did you use to play? Sometimes we're going to have a compliment, sometimes we're not. In this case, we don't have a compliment. But uh, what sports? That's the WH word. That follows auxiliary did. And then after that, we're going to have a subject. After that, we're going to have used to. Notice that used to is in the present. And that follows the verb in its present form. Then sometimes you're going to have a compliment, sometimes you're not. So let me write a couple of more questions here so that you can get the hang of it. What uh, video games did you 
used to play when you wear a kit. Okay, that'll be another one. So what video games, that will be my WH word, it follows the etc. did, subject is you, used to, and the verb in its present form, and then whatever complement. The last thing that I would like for you to do is to practice making questions. You're going to make yes or no questions and also WH questions. What I'm going to do at this time is I'm going to post some answers. And what you're going to do is you're going to come up with the best possible question to the answers that are stated here. You need to identify whether the answer is from a yes or no question or is it from a, a WH question and um, answer that accordingly. All right, so this is what we're going to do. Okay, now we're going to speak about past. What is past? Past is when you were a baby until now. When you were a baby, a kid, a teenager, a young adult, an adult, single, married. Okay, so let's start when you were a baby. Did you used to eat Herber. <laughs> Good. Oh, hey, so I'm going to be like compliment. Did you used to eat Gerber? Remember Gerber? <coughs> when you were a baby? Yes, I used to eat Gerber. 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 Como gato, Gerber. 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 Okay, good. Me too. I used to eat Gerber when I was a bit. Sometimes I eat Gerber when I am. <laughs> I like I like banana. It's good. Teacher, Gerber is like yogurt. Yes, it's the baby food. It's like a puree. Like Papi. Francisco, you don't know Gerber? <laughs> Oh my, oh my God. I think, I don't, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Gerber, uh, in, in the bottle, this glass and there was a baby. Okay, so, did you understand that? Entendió uh, Marvel, Daniel, Melissa? Did you, did you used to eat Gerber when you were a baby? The answer, two possibles. Two possible answers. Yes, I used to eat to Gerber, eat Gerber when, when I was when a baby. Was... Y por favor, háganlo completo, okay? Porque ese problema que tenemos los abuelos que solo decimos, yes, no. <laughs> no sé si han visto, o oh, si no lo han visto, se los recomiendo cuando la Tenchis va a pedir La visa. <coughs> Veanlo en Google. Porque ella dice, no, mira el truco, tenés que decir tres veces yes y dos veces no. Y, solo decía eso. <laughs> <laughs> y cuando le hacían las preguntas, yes, yes, <laughs> no, yes. Es, es bien chistoso eso. Veanlo en YouTube. So, pero por eso, answer complete. 
So one more time, did you used to eat Gerber when you were a baby? Yes, I used to yes. eat Gerber when, when I was when a I baby. Was baby. Yes, I used to eat Gerber when I was a baby. Okay, yes, so. I used to in Caparina when I, I was a baby. Excuse me, but in Caparina is not a verb. In Caparina. It's... No es verbo. You said no, I... Eh, Gerber. no, but listen, you said yes, I used it's, to it's missing a verb. in it's... Caparina. Okay, this okay. is what you said. ¿Qué va después de used to? It. It. The ah, verb. I used, I used to eat in Caparina okay. when I was a baby. There you go. Very good. And, um, and aguita de arroz, too. <laughs> Yes. Oh, so, yes. Remember, this is important because in Caparina no verbo. So I used to. I used eat. to eat. But in Caparina is eat or drink? No, I eat Gerber. Mm, drink, maybe. Yeah, I think in Caparina. Drink. Can... Drink. So drink. Tomado. when I was a baby. So yes, I used to drink in Caparina when I was a baby. Ahora, esto yo les recomiendo para practicar su fluidez. Porque aquí van, quiero que hagan dos cosas de un solo. Una, entender lo que están diciendo y dos, mm -hmm. díganlo. Porque hay mucha gente que va a decir así. Yes, I used to drink in Caparina when I was a baby. You need a teacher to ask it very good. Y se va a ir a la próxima pregunta. Pero a mí no me dejó muy contento como dijeron eso. Vale. Porque se notó que les costó. Entonces, mentira, mañana ya se les olvidó. Entonces, se dice así. El primero lo hacemos. Yes. Hagámoslo en tres. So, so repeat after me. Yes, I used to drink in Caparina. Repeat. Yes, yes, yes I used to drink, drink in Caparina. Caparina. When I was a baby. When I was a, baby. Was a baby. 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 So if you notice three parts, one, two, and three parts. So one more time. Yes, I used to yes. drink in Caparina. Repeat. Yes, yes, I used to drink When I was a baby. When I was a baby. Okay, now let's say it in two. Yes. Repeat. Yes. 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 I used to drink in Caparina when I was a baby. I okay, and now say it complete. Yes, I used to drink in Caparina when I was a baby. Drinking Caparina when I was a baby. Very good, thank you. Um, le hiciste bien el chavo, Daniel, cuando están todos hablando y el chavo termina. Ok, very good. Esto es una recomendación. Cuando les cuesta decir algo, díganlo en partes. Si es necesario, una por una. Si, díganlo en cinco. En cuatro, en tres, en dos, en uno. Hasta que lo agarren. Si, si es muy fácil en cinco, díganlo en cuatro. Si aún es fácil, díganlo en tres. Si les cuesta en tres, síganlo diciendo en tres hasta que puedan en dos, en una. Ok. So, vamos a ver. Samuel. Yes, teacher. Did you used to eat Flintstones vitamins? When you were a baby? No, I didn't used to eat Flintstone I, vitamins, you said? Yes. No, I no? didn't. <laughs> Flintstones, what? Pica Piedra. Remember the Flintstone vitamins? They were good. Yes, I remember, but I didn't. Uh, All right. Them. Okay, good. Daniel Palacios, did you used to eat Pope chocolate when you were younger? <clears throat> No, uh, oh. I just no. 
Usually, me quedé. Okay, sorry. good. No, 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 no. It's okay. Very good. Thank you. Okay. Necesito entender algo. ¿Quién le pregunté? Que si había comido chocolate. Oh, uh, no, 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 Melissa. Hold on. I'm sorry. Thank you, Melissa. But, uh, Daniel. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you. For me, quick, but I'm at... Daniel, ¿qué le pregunté? Si usualmente no. toma. Okay. 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 Hagámoslo más fácil. Used to solía. 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 Mm, o sea, le pregunté, did you used to eat Popeye chocolate? Chocolate de Popeye. Ajá. ¿Qué le pregunté? Si. 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 Comí, sí, comí, salía comer chocolate. Quería comer chocolate de Popeye. Good. Eso es lo que estamos practicando. Good. Solía. Did you used to eat chocolate, uh, Popeye chocolate? Two possible answers. Yes or no? No. No. Yo sé. No, yo sé tú y chocolate Popeye. Ok, good. So listen, no, ok. Um, vean la diferencia. Used, aquí lleva de y aquí no. ¿Por eh, qué? Peter no está presentando. No comparte la pantalla. No, no, no ha compartido pantalla. Tenemos la imagen del video todavía. ¿En serio? Sí. Ahora sí. Escribe... Oh my God, I'm sorry. Yo aquí escribiéndole eso. <laughs> Ahora ok, sí. so, ok. So I said, did you used to eat chocolate Popeye when you were, cuando usted era joven, younger, a little boy, a baby, whatever in the past? Two possible answers. Yes, I used to eat chocolate. Aquí hicimos drink porque estaba haciendo el, el, el anterior, pero el verbo, right? Yes, I used Teacher. to eat. Teacher. Yes. I had a question. Yes. Used to. Y the pronoun is saying used to. Yes. Y and that is the correct. The sound, the sound, the sound is, is silent. It's silent. But that was a very good pronunciation. Used, I used. I used to. Okay. Terminamos con una media escupidita. I used to. All right. So, this is two possible answers. So, yes, I used to eat Popeye chocolate, or no, I didn't used to eat uh, Popeye chocolate. Daniel, en serio, no, no solía comer Popeye. Oh, my God, that was the no. best solo, chocolate. Solo las, solo las miraba, pero no tenía para comprarla. Oh, no. Ojalá volviera su chocolate. It was very good. Pero sí, me recuerdo. Yes. Ese chocolate. Uh -huh. Entonces, miren, cuando hacemos una pregunta sin, sin W, sin what, when, where, solo de un solo, did you... Two possible answers, yes or no. Let me see, where are my, my San Miguelian girls? Oh, there's Alba and Evelyn. Evelyn. Yeah. I'm sorry, Evelyn, how old are you? 29. Okay. I... No sé, ok, si aún existe o no, pero... Did you used to go to El Sarape en San Miguel? Yes, I used to go to El Sarape en San Miguel. Ok. It still exist? No. No more? It doesn't exist. Oh. No, no more. It was good. El Sarape was good. All right. Alba. <laughs> yeah. No, I remember... Still, uh, 
Yes. I remember the show. Yes. Yes. El imitador de Juan Gabriel was funny. <laughs> it was funny. Alba, how old are you? 29. Oh, you two are 29. Let 29. me see. Okay, good. <laughs> Did you used to go to Mama Gallina? Oh, no, Papa no. Gallo. No, I didn't used to go to Mama Gallina. And so now you know. it doesn't exist. It doesn't, Mama Gallina doesn't exist anymore. No, they are building another, I, I don't know what it is, but they are building another, um, maybe uh, restaurant. I don't know, because it's in construction. But okay. Mama Gallina doesn't exist anymore. I remember Papagayo. Papagayo was a good bar. Oh, really? I frequently used to go to Papa Every, Papa weekend. <laughs> Every Wednesday, night? no, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, very good. Let me see. Thank you, girls from San Miguel. Who is from Santa Ana? Where, where is my student from Santa Ana? Who is it? <laughs> Carmen, are you driving? No, I, I don't drive. Okay. It, it looks like you're driving. No, are no, you? I'm not driving. Okay, good. Who is from Santa Ana? Is it you, Sara? I remember there's a woman here from Santa Ana. <laughs> Oh, okay, no, no. All right, okay. Eso es lo que quiero que hagan. Hoy ustedes se van a hacer preguntas. Yes? So, for example, Evelyn. Evelyn, please. Yes? Okay, remember, this yes? is past. This is past. So, the complement. Ven, ven mi pisarla, right? Yes. So then the complement is when you were. ¿Qué un pasado para todos nosotros ahorita? Cuando tú eras a baby. When you were in school. When you were a teenager. When you were 10. When you were in. In kindergarten. When you were single. Remember? Okay. So, Evelyn, please ask somebody. Did you used to play? Who, 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 who? Uh, Oscar. All right. Did you, okay. Hello. Did you used to play? No. I don't know if you know that game with Landa or Mika. So, no sé si lo conoce como Landa o como Mika. Como Mika. Ok. En San Miguel se llama Landa, por eso le pregunto. In ah, English, okay. in English is tag. If you tag. Sí, ¿eh? Tag. Yes. Okay. Incluso sea el verbo, you, you tag. Is, Ah, okay. Okay. Nunca you, ponen, Hola, me llamo. A es un tag. Uh -huh. Se pega, uh -huh. un tag. Ah, okay. Nunca han ido a una reunión que dice, Hola, me llamo y, y le quitan oh, el. Ok. So, ese sería el verbo. Es, es un verbo, ¿eh? <ríe> es un verbo y un nombre también. Pero miren, la expresión sí. tag es como pegar. ¿Y qué es? Mica. Mica. No sé qué es. <laughs> you never Anda. You don't used to play You Mika. didn't used to play Mika when you were a little girl? Escondelero Mika. Ah. Mika is when you run. Ah, Mika. And you go back. Ah, Landa. It's correct. And now the, the, the generation today juegan eso on their tablets. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, you have to Mika on tablet. Oh my yes, God. Yes, yes. All right, so very good question. Continue, please, Evelyn. One more time. Okay. Uh, well, I have a question. Tag is a verb. So 
I have to say play tag. No, no, but in this case, tag. tag is a name too. Ah, okay. Entonces, did you use yes. play tag when you were uh, 10 years old? It, yes, I, I used to play tag when I was a kid. Very good. Did you used to play mother and father? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Uh, the, uh, uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay. <laughs> Ask Francisco, did you used to play mother and father? Oh, he's in trouble. No. Okay, very good. <laughs> Oscar, your turn, please. Ask a lady. A lady. Um, okay. Did you use to uh, um, Did you use to um, uh, go to the to the movies or? Uh, or oh, theater when uh, you are you were a child with your parents. I don't know if la formula bien. Yes, but who again? Ah, okay, uh, from uh, Iris Mulato. Repítame la pregunta, por favor. No escuché bien. Okay. Uh, did you used to uh, go to the uh, Theater, theater. Uh, to the movies. When I go oh, to the movies, okay. Did you used to uh, go to the movies uh, with your parents when you uh, were a child? No, I, I, no, I didn't used to go <laughs> go um, theater movie. Ay, se me olvidó la otra parte que me dijo. When, with my parents. Ah, uh, with my parents, sí. ¿Está bien? ¿Cómo lo yes, hizo? yes, it was very good. All right, very good. Good question, yeah. Oscar. Okay, thank y, you. Y la hizo un poco larga también. <laughs> sí, es que por, <laughs> por eso se me olvidó. Did you used to go to the movies with your parents when you were a child? Man, it's long. <laughs> okay. All right, very good. It is your turn, please. Ask a, uh, ask a gentleman. Ah, uh, ver. A Daniel. Daniel. Se la puedo hacer a Daniel? Yes. Well, Daniel, Daniel. Bye. Where is Daniel? The... No sé si oh, está. Yes, yes, Daniel. Daniel, are you uh, there? What Daniel? What? What Daniel? Ah, permítame, quiero ver. Daniel, Daniel Edgardo. Oh, ok. Démosle, démosle, démosle. Ah, bye. Este, did you used to uh, watch Messenger when you were uh, little? Yes, I, I used to, I used to watch, I used to watch Messenger when when I was a kid. Okay. All right. Very good, Daniel. I too. I too. Okay. Me too. <laughs> uh, me too. Me too. Me <laughs> too. All right. Your turn, Daniel. Okay. My turn. Okay. Let me see. Alba Roxana, ya participó? Yes, I did. Okay. Quiero ver Marvel. Sí, we, Marvel. we have Carmen, we have Alba, uh -huh. you have Maria <laughs> Stella, ah, Jacqueline Carmen, Chavez, Carmen. que no sabemos Estamos si están ni Nidia Payas. <laughs> Carmen Lisset, did you use to, to watch, to watch uh, Candy Bells when you was a, a child? Candy Bells. What is candy bell? Candy. Candy. Candy, candy bells or candy? candy. candy. Oh, candy. Sorry, candy. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't know, but I I think that is a comic, right? Candy. Yes. Yes, it's about a bear. Remember candy. Heidi and Candy? Uh huh. Heidi and Candy. 
Is Heidi. Heidi. Candy. There was Heidi. Heidi yeah. Yeah, but ah, okay. there was Heidi right. and okay. there was Candy. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. Yes, I used to watch the Candy series when I was a child. Okay, good. All right, me too. I used no, to watch no. Candy and Heidi. No, I, Candy I, era más I, yes. I didn't used to, in my, in my case, I didn't used to watch Candy. <laughs> you didn't? Oh, I did because my grandmother. I didn't. I, I didn't. All right, good. Oh, okay. All right, very good. Thank you. Okay, Carmen Lisa, your turn. Carmen, your turn, please. Ask a gentleman, ask Canado, ask Marvel, ask, oh, Francisco. Okay, sorry. Except Oscar, Genaro. because Oscar participated. Okay, Genaro. Hi. Uh, did you used to go to the theater when you were a boy, a little boy? Repeat the question, Carmen. Did you used to go to the theater when you were a little boy? I know this that uh, the Seattle. Theater. theater. What? Cinemark, Variedades. Ah, okay. Um, okay. Majestic. Majestic yes. Theater, okay, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes. Darío. España. España. Do you understand theater? She was happy. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yes, I used to uh, watch movie uh, when uh, a teenager. Okay, very good, Genaro, but very good, except one thing. Listen to the question. Carmen, can you please repeat? Did you used to go to the theater when you were a boy, a little boy? Yes, I used to. Uh, I go cinema uh, or senior theater. I little senior. When uh, I was little boy. When I was. When I was a little boy. A little boy. Very good. Buena pronunciación tiene, Genaro. So, hoy practiquemos solo decirlo todo completo. The complete sentence. Okay, Genaro, very good. Thank you. Your turn. Please ask Alba, ask Evelyn, ask Maria Stella. <coughs> ask Maria Stella. Nidia, creo que nunca le he oído hablar. Uh, yes, oh, I'm here. Oh, hi, Nidia. Ask Nidia. Hi. Your option. <laughs> <laughs> Maria Stella. Okay. Did you used to swim in uh, when you were teenager? When you were. When you were. Yes. <coughs> but look at one thing here, um, Genaro. Did you used to? Excellent. Mm -hmm. Swim. Swim. When? Did you used to Just swim? No swimming. Swim. Did you used to swim? When, when you were a teenager. You were teenager. Okay. Yes, I used to swim uh, when I was teenager. Excellent. <laughs> Your turn, Maria. <laughs> Perdón. It's okay. Uh, <clears throat> Jose Álvaro. Uh, José. José. José Álvaro. Uh, ya le preguntaron Oye, a José. Ya claro. le preguntaron. Yes, eh, Francisco Javier. Francisco. Oh, Oh, Daniel hi, hi, sorry. Here I am. Okay. Francisco, do you used to learn 
la, la uh, something language when 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 you when you are when you when you were a teenager very good something language no no oh, i didn't wait, wait, excuse me francisco, learn francisco excuse me hold on did okay. you used to learn a different language a deep okay maybe did you when you were use... in high school mm -hmm. okay did you used to to learn a other other language that's good too mm -hmm. when, okay when you were in high school yes i used to learn another <laughs> language when i was teenager but never learned okay. really <laughs> it happens right now but right now you, you are Eight. learning english right now <laughs> right now i am learning. all right good uh Francisco, did you used to like Pamela Anderson? <laughs> ah, when, when no did puede you know, when? My, my wife. <laughs> when? when? It's, it's you, you were, I don't you were in this question. <laughs> ah, come on, be open mind. No me vas a querer. Sabes que a, a mi esposa, a mi esposa en, en el día de sol, ¿cuándo es la fiesta soltera de ella? Uh, Yo le mandé despedida. strippers. Despedida de soltera. Yeah. <laughs> Yo le mandé strippers, imagine. I, I, I can say open mind. <laughs> okay, very good, thank you. Francisco, your turn. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Let me check. Estará ahí Domínguez. <laughs> Saraí, where are you in that picture? Mm, I was in the, I don't know how to say, La Brigada, the Quinta Brigada. Quinta Brigada, that's San Miguel, no? San Miguel. San Vicente. Oh, okay. <laughs> Danger. Oh, yes, I remember. You, you have your, your bakery. Yes. All right, cool. All right, so ask Sarai, please. Okay. I'm sorry, okay. uh, are, are you a baker or you're a chef? Mm, I used to study in the university, but I studied graphic designer. Okay. But I go to the, I don't know how to say, diplomados about bakery, pastry. Pastry, oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Hey, nice. Interesting. Can you make budding? Yes, I, I can. You know, budding is like pupusas. Todo mundo lo hace, pero no bien. <laughs> it's very yeah. strange to find a good budding. You know, you go, mm, this is good. <laughs> yes. Like pupusas everywhere. Pupusas in every corner, but not all are good. Siempre hay una, like, todos are good. O sopa de pata, you know. Yeah. Uh, okay, Francisco, ask Sarai, please. Hey, Sarai, do you still play Jack when you were a child? A child. Child. Yes, I remember that I used to play with my sisters. All right, good. Did you used to play with Barbies? Yes, I used to. <laughs> Me too. I used to play with Barbies. Yeah. <laughs> yes. But I used to fight with my sister because I used to <laughs> take her Barbies and marry and play with my toys, like mm -hmm, kiss. <laughs> <laughs> with my G.I. Joes, you know. You, you, play, uh, you, you, you 
Ken. Okay. No, no, Ken. G.I. Joe. So, uh, G. My G. toys Joe. used to celebrate the party. So I G. used G. to Joe. take. <laughs> yes, after the battle. Mm -hmm. So I used to take my sister's Barbies and go celebrate with my G.I. Joe's or Rambo. But my sister, my mom. <laughs> Yes, I told you, I was a terrible boy. I used to be a terrible boy. But now I am good. Now is my son the terrible. <laughs> okay, Sarai, your turn. Please ask, Mar ask Marvel. I want to hear Marvel. Okay. Marvel, uh, did, did you use, did you use have pets when you was, when you were a child? Can you please repeat? Did you use have pets? Did you use you two? Did you used to have pets when you were a child? Good. No comprendo. Ah, uh, excuse. No le digan que es pets. Háganlo con palabras hasta que él entienda. Go, Sarai. It's, I don't know. Did you use have some? Dogs, or dogs, cats, mascotas. ¿Quién dijo mascotas? ¿Quién fue? Se va a ir a la esquina. Yo la voy a mover a la esquina. No. No, yo. No, I didn't use to. No, I didn't use to uh, pets. Have pets. Have pets. pets. Okay. Really, you didn't used to have pets? No. I used to have a turtle and a fish. Turtle. Turtle. Mm -hmm. Turtle, like ninja turtles. Ne turtle, turtle. Yeah. Yeah. I used to have a turtle and a pet. I I'm sorry, and a fish. fish. Mm -hmm. I have a dog. Oh, okay. And my turtle ate the fish. <laughs> Can you imagine? Terrible. I cried. All right. Very good. Marvel, please ask Melissa. Se llamaba Leo. <laughs> Leo. No, no my, uh, my turtle, I think the name was Mr. Green. Mr. Green. Yeah. Oh, it was green. Chevy is funny. Yeah. It was original. <laughs> okay, yeah, Marvel. Mr. Green. <laughs> Melissa. Melissa, did you used to paint uh, at school when you were a kid? Yes, I used to paint in the school when I was a kid. Una pregunta, Marvel. De usted salió esa pregunta. La... La escribí hace rato. Ok, no, but very good. Es que la dijo bien rápida, como, hmm. <risa> <risa> o estaba en el video, o, o en algún libro. No, but very good, very good. ¿Qué le preguntó? Uh, <risa> ¿Ah? Que si pintaba cuando estaba en la escuela. Y solía pintar. Yeah, very good, all right, very good. Melissa Trujillo, did you used to paint when you were in school? Yes, I I used to I used to paint and when I when I were in this when I was in the school. Very good. Please ask me. Ask me a question. Okay. Did you did you used to have many girlfriends when you were in high school? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> okay. Open, open my. Yes. Tell Honestly, the truth. Yeah, it's okay. idea. It's the they idea. Work, they work, <laughs> open my. They work on environment. Honestly, yes, I used to have a lot of girlfriends when I was in high school. I but suppose, I suppose. I imagine. <laughs> but, imagine. but okay. It, it was. It I was. Guess? It was easy because. <laughs> There was no uh -oh. cell phones, no WhatsApp, no no social media. My only, only yeah, or telephone, a public telephone. 
So, how do you I, say I, señales de humo? On your, on your, smoke ride, signs. Ride the car. Smoke on your signs. Riding in car. Yes, writing in cards. Yes, I used to. I used to have a lot of girlfriends when I was in high school. But it was not good. I mean, it's not. I don't I recommend it. your face. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's in my face. No. No, no. I'm I'm a good boy now. <laughs> okay. No. <laughs> All right, but very good. Good questions. Good questions. All right. Así se pregunta. Did you used to? Yes, I used to. No, I didn't used to. Now let me see. Da, 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 da. Let me see. Rico. Okay. Oh, Jacqueline. Okay. I'm sorry, Jacqueline. Did you? Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Okay. Did you used to eat Herbert when you were a baby? Yes, I used to eat Herbert when I was a baby. And, and sometimes now I eat a Gerber one. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. I love Gerber. <laughs> Me too. I like it. The banana is my favorite. Mm -hmm. Yes. Did you use to, like strange things when you were a baby? For example, did you used to eat tortilla with lemon and salt? No. You see, look at the yeah. old generation and the new generation. Yes. The old generation to talks. Yes. 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 I used to eat. I used to eat. Yes, I did. Lemon and salt. It's good. <laughs> yes. Oh, San Miguel, mamazo. Hey, yeah. I used to eat mamazo in San Miguel. In in my in my in my country, the same the name. Where are you same from? Name. I live in Cuscatlan, San Pedro Prolapan. But you said my country or my country, city, country, city, my, country. Uh, or my town, my town, town. Okay. Oh, okay. It's the same name. Yes, I remember in, in San Miguel, I used to get a tortilla or two. A bowl. It just, a bowl. In uh, in a bag. And squish yeah. with with cheese. Yeah. Wow. Cheers. And oh man, it was very <laughs> good. La libertad too. Oh really? And it's called yeah. mamazo. Mamazo. Yes. Yes, I used to eat mamazo. I used to eat mamazo. Okay, very good. <laughs> All right. Okay, class. Thank you very much. Okay. I hope you have a good, good weekend. Recuerden, este, este, es, este es el, eh, el consejo que les voy a dar de hoy. Es cuando, si ustedes quieren practicar su, su fluidez, hoy todos lo están haciendo muy bien. Es notado que aquí todos tienen, se entiende bien cuando hablan. Sí, se oyen algunos errores de, de gramática, pero eso, como les dije el primer día, o sea, de las tres cosas hay que nivelarlas. Eh, Si ustedes quieren practicar, les voy a dar una gran recomendación. Lean libros de niños. ¿Por qué? Van a practicar fluidez, no comprensión. ¿Qué es fluidez? Lo que les dije hoy. Cuando, si les cuesta decir una oración larga, díganla en partes. O una palabra. ¿Les cuesta decir una palabra? Dígala por sílabas. Refrigerator. Incluso hasta en español. Refrigeradora. Nadie se lo va a decir a alguien que está aprendiendo español. Nadie se lo va a decir así el primero. Entonces uno dice, ok, decirlo. Refrigeradora. Cinco. Hoy, hoy digámoslo en cuatro. Refrigeradora. Hoy digámoslo en dos. Hasta que lo agarren. Entonces, ¿por qué les recomiendo leer libros de niños? Porque, para empezar, es un libro que está hecho para niños. Entonces, el vocabulario tiene que ser bien sencillo. Y solo es una oración o dos. Entonces, imagínense, la primera página. Boom. Mickey Mouse went to the store. Y uno puede decir, pero eso está fácil, Mickey Mouse fue a la tienda. No, no estamos practicando comprensión. Estamos practicando fluidez porque quiero que lo digan así. Mickey Mouse went to the store. 
Siguiente página. He bought two apples, one orange, and one, uh, and one banana. Y a las diez páginas termina el libro y pueden no leer. Mickey Mouse went to the store and he bought one apple, two oranges, and one banana. Hasta que se lo oiga natural. Yes? El problema es que hay gente que se pone a leer Harry Potter <laughs> o El Señor de los Anillos y, y esperan milagros que no, no puedo, que, ni puedo decir. Creo que ni alguien nativo puede decir eso porque es bien confuso, ¿me entiendes? Igual, igual a la hora de ver, de ver películas. Yo he tenido mucha gente que me dice, no, profe, me dice, ya, ya me voy por vencido. Tengo cuatro años estudiando inglés y aquel día puse una película, no la entendí. Yo le dije, me acaba de decir usted algo muy importante. Me dijo, tiene cuatro años de estar estudiando. Entonces usted está quizás a nivel de un niño de 11 años. A nivel de hablar el idioma, no, no inteligencia ni nada, eso aparte. Entonces, ¿por qué le está viendo rápido y furioso? Y eso es como yo le, yo le decía a él, yo tengo una sobrina que tiene 11 años. Ella aquí nació, habla español y todo. Pero le apuesto que si yo le pongo a ella Joaquín Sabina, ella no va a entender qué está diciendo él. ¿Por qué? Porque, pero es español. Sí, pero Sabina no hace música para niñas de 11 años. Creo que hay gente más hasta mayor que él ni entiende qué puerca está diciendo. Como, what the hell? Porque habla todo sofisticado, habla con caliche, etcétera, etcétera. Entonces ustedes tienen que ver algo de acuerdo al nivel que ustedes están. Yo les yo le recomiendo mucho, vean Plaza Sésamo, en inglés obviamente. Sesame Street is good. Pero ahí están ustedes también. Si ustedes sienten, no, esto está ridículo. Para niños, no, no es eso. Porque si entienden un episodio completo, estamos bien. Y van avanzando un poco. Pero no vayan a ver South Park. <ríe> Qué bueno, pero pobre, un gran caliche. Pónganse a pensar, si ustedes estuvieran enseñando español a, a un gringo adulto, diríamos que él está en básico. ¿Qué le pusieran de video? ¿A que viera el chavo o la familia peluche? Dora la exploradora. No, pero si tienen esas dos opciones, ¿qué, qué vieron? Ah, Dora la exploradora, bueno. El chavo. El chavo. El chavo. ¿Por qué? Sí, porque es el más fácil. El hecho es más sencillo. Aunque quizás es más aburrido y todo eso, pero no sé es el punto. Lo que ustedes quieren que él aprenda y cuál entendió más. Porque para él llegar a entender el nivel de familia peluche, no solo tiene que entender el idioma, también la cultura. El todo. entorno, el contexto de los, de los familiares. Exacto. Uh -huh. Entonces ese es el problema que mucha gente hace, de que se ponen a estudiar o leer algo. Y quizá a veces no están estudiando lo que deben de. Entonces yo por eso a este mi alumno lo puse a ver Toy Story. Toy Story es muy buena porque es, es para todo público. Significa que lo va a entender un niño de 5 años y el otro niño 95 años. <risa> ¿Ya? En todo. Es, así deben de estudiar, ¿ok? Yes, I understand. All right. Thank you so much. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It's my, it's my first time that, that they tell me that I buy. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. Ya, en música, en música. Repite, 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 pero never, never say me read a book a child. Yes, for children. Mm -hmm. <laughs> música, escuchen música de los cincuentas en inglés. Es bien sencillo porque solo son tres oraciones, el coro y tres oraciones. Boom. No escuchen Eminem. <laughs> it's, it's clear. And clear. <laughs> yes. Uh huh. Slip not. <laughs> yes. Okay. Have a good weekend. Okay. Thank you very much. Goodbye, teacher. Bye bye. I'll see you Monday. Bye. 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 Good job today.